So, I just researched it. Yes, it is definitely Marilyn Monroe's granddaughter. Marilyn Monroe, one of the facts that you didn't know about her, and I had to research it, she had cross dominance and dyslexia, just like I do. She didn't know where to put the I in Marilyn, just like I did it. M A R L I Y N. Wait, no. M A R I L Y N. M O N R O E. See what I'm saying? Okay. And that wasn't me trying to fake it or whatnot. No. I have to really think about where to put the I and the L, just like Grandma Marilyn Monroe did. Okay? I'm her direct descendant bloodline. Look at my eyes. Look at the eyes. Direct descendant bloodline. Match it up with the pose from Marilyn, Man from Marilyn Monroe. With the same height of eyes that I have now. Okay. Anyways, Marilyn Monroe. Wear reading glasses. Guess what? I wear reading glasses. Some of the fun facts that you don't know about the Monroe family. We have vision problems. And we have slight lazy eye. We have slight lazy eye. Okay. That would make sense why my foot is slinky and sexy. Because it's the same foot that Marilyn Monroe has. She had this size hand. Literally everything. I am made of Marilyn Monroe. I could be very well be the second coming of Marilyn Monroe. I don't know. More more research needs done. So I'm testing it. If I get the modeling acting career, you know I'm her I'm her granddaughter reincarnated as Marilyn Monroe. Okay. Some of the mistakes I will make as second coming of Marilyn Monroe, I will never be in Playboy, Playgirl, none of it. I will never be in a Hustler mag. I won't be in any of those filth magazines. Okay, never. If there's a filth picture out there of me, it better be removed or you will be hearing from my agent and my attorney with a cease and desist letter. Okay. It would be in a submissive pose. Okay? And I was forced into doing it. Why? Because the sick bastard knew that I was Marilyn Monroe's granddaughter. Jennifer Danko's daughter. Taylor Mumpson's daughter. Avril Lavigne's daughter. It's all me. I'm their daughter. And... What's a Milano mom... What the hell are you thinking, Embrace the Vampire? And I'm only, like, six years old when that came out. Being forced to watch it and shit. Yeah, I know how an attraction to you, Alyssa Milano. You're gross. Okay? The healthy ones are the family. Are me, Grandma Fox, Grammy Naomi. We're the healthy ones. We're the good ones. We all have disabilities. We would never pose nude. We would never do anything that would degrade ourselves. If we knew what we were doing, we would never degrade ourselves. Yeah, you know why that? You know why that photo? Let me show you the glass line. Okay? That photo. You know why I did that photo? He told me my mom was dead. He told me my mommy was dead unless I did that photo. He should be arrested. He's a yellow cab driver. Then he sent my mommy. Then he sent my mommy and Banco to me. She starred in Blair Witch Part 2, Book of Shadows. So, mommy, guess what? I created a cult awakening. Book of Shadows Part 2. I want to be just like you, mommy. In horror films. And documentaries. Like the nude. I won't do it. I'll turn the crate down. No. You're not having me nude. No way in hell. Anyways. I really, really, really want a new life. I want the type of new life that I dream of. 
Not that everybody else is it. No, it's not them. It's me. I want to go live with Grammy Naomi or Mommy Jennifer Banco. The one that makes a lot of money. She a corrections officer or a phallic driver. I want to live with you, Mommy. Jennifer Banco. Mom, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to call you Jenny. I was calling my bitch sister Jennifer Jenny. You're nice, Jennifer Banco. My mommies. Jen Banco's nah. I mean, uh, not Jen. Jen Banco's a sweetheart. Jennifer, my sister. Mom, paddle her rear end. She did bondage in front of me and it freaked me out. Get with her, Mom. Tell her she has to come back and her and I have a black wedding. Bring, bring, Mommy. I'd like a black wedding with you. But Jennifer made a promise to Grandma Naomi and Grammy Fox that she would be with me. Mom, you have my word. The clothes never come off. Jennifer's blonde, Carol's blonde. I don't want to see Jennifer's body. I go in the bathtub. I'm sitting up front. She's sitting behind me, massaging my shoulders, and she never gets dirty with me. I get in first, sit down, step forward, or I look at the wall that's closest to me. And then Jennifer Banco can, whatever, sit down behind me. She's the first one to get out of the bathtub, too, and she, she doesn't try to flash her booty in front of me or whatnot. She doesn't do that crap. She gets out of the bathtub, and she walks out the door, and she wraps her towel. She completely dries off, and then I say, are you, let me know when you are done and you are fully clothed. She's my sister. I need her to rub the soap all into my back. She ain't touching my way in. She ain't touching any of my parts. She putting the water and soap on my back. And she gonna be nice and gentle with it. Jennifer, I would never sleep with any of you, Jennifer's. What makes you think that I got a sexual attraction? I don't think that way. Alyssa Milano, ooh, when mom gets all of that, and she will swatch your rear. You know she will. Up to this day. You want to switch from Grandma Naomi? That's your mama, Alyssa Milano. Grandma Naomi Banco. You want to switch from Grandma Naomi? She ain't hesitating to switch any of our rear ends. Moms and sisters. You piss Grandma Naomi on. She'll make you pull a switch. And paddle you on the rear. Reason why I'm laughing? Yeah, because they about to get in trouble by Grandma Naomi for trying to get dirty with me. Ain't people are do this, do that. I'm sick of your, I'm sick of my sister's bullshit. This is her one opportunity to make everything all right. Therefore, you don't make it right. You wonder, am I alive or dead? And I'm to this country, to this city, to this state, to this province, to this territory. I'll never find out the truth, Jennifer, if I'm still alive or dead. Mom will know. Mom will be told to keep her mouth shut, and Mom will keep her mouth shut. Otherwise, this Mom, Shannon Doherty, steps into play. I'm pissed with all my kids, except Marilyn Banco. How dare you lie to Marilyn Monroe, my daughter. This one right here. There's a reason why I had her pick out the black wig like mine. I'm her mom, Shannon Doherty. You ever fuck with my cub again? I will put a boot up your ass. This is my cub. You ever fuck with her again? You're dealing with me and Courtney Love. Mom, no. No, don't. No, they fuck you over. They fuck with you. They're getting it. And nobody knows my true identity. Nobody knows where I'm hiding out. And nobody knows where mom Courtney loves at. Why are you going to do this, mommy? 
it's gonna hurt me because your sisters are gonna make amends to you and they're gonna do it now. Every one of them last cunts owes you an amends. Mom, just let it go. They hate me. They don't love me. Nobody does. That is not true. And you never say that again. You're going to paddle for me. When I see you again, everybody loves you. Everybody gets sick with you. That's the problem. That is why she needs her precious banco. And Jennifer, you're going to deal with me, Shannon Doherty. You're big and powerhouse to fuck with your sister and fuck her up good. When I get a hold of you, you're getting a paddle. You're getting a switch, and then you're getting a belt straight across your ass. It's better than the alternative, Jennifer. You're not going to hurt your baby sister, Marilyn Monroe, ever again. It likes to be called Marilyn Banco, and we're all pissed. She's not a Banco, she's Monroe. You lied to her. Now, we're going to swatch your ass. You got one coming from me. You got one coming from Jen Banco. Jennifer Banco, the correction officer. Jennifer Banco, the South driver. Jennifer Banco, the one that works at TG. You got swats coming from all of us, Jennifer. You better get it in order. You better get it together. Because you know how arcane magic works. And now I'm going to channel her grandmother, throwing her grandmother, Marilyn Monroe, gets the ultimate thing. So, Jennifer, mighty and all powerful, huh? You don't go to her? I don't know. Now, you know which grandma I am, Jennifer. Put it this way, Courtney Love sent me. I found out Marilyn, in fact, was innocent of everything. That's why I said, I'm they coming through? Oh, she said, I said, I don't know. Meaning, she did just that. Just what family wanted her to do. Family would come to her aid. Don't hurry you fucking with me. I don't use that word that often. Jennifer, you're messing with me. Naomi, Banco. Why do you think I came up and hugged Michael? Had a meeting. I said, Hi, Michael. It's Naomi. I'm here for you. I wanted to call so bad. I was your grandmother. You paid it off so that it would just be grandma. Or so that it would just be Naomi. I'm here for you. I had to do it. I'm here for you part without you realizing your dust ever. You know, the truth of your sister. The beggar with your life. Why for me? Naomi Bank home. This is not right. Don't destroy the precious love of my life. No. No. If she hurts you, she's done. No. What does the Holy Bible say about honoring the mother and father? And why I plead with you as your baby sister. Don't leave me. I don't want to see anything bad happen to you. Please don't be bad with me. I'm sorry for counting you down when I was nine years old. I'm sorry. You didn't understand. Don't fault me. Don't hate me. Please. I love you.